Hey guys, thank you so much for joining to watch this video. Today I just wanted to jump on here and do some of my sales that have been selling for me on eBay. I had some really great sales. I was also running a sale for some of these that sold as well. I do like to pretty aggressively run sales. Um, I would say weekly I kind of try and run a sale if sales are slow or not moving. Um, running a sale is a great way to get my store back in business and moving. If you are new here, my name is Destiny and I am a full-time reseller on eBay and on Poshmark. I sell men's clothing and women's clothing and I also do sell a little bit of shoes. So I'm just gonna share what's selling for me on eBay. First item that we sold is Vineyard Vines. This is a women's Vineyard Vines. It was called the Harbor Shift Dress. I do like selling Vineyard Vines. I love selling the Vineyard Vines men's. They're called the On The Go. If you find their performance shorts or pants, really great pickup. Um, also the Women's Vineyard Vine dresses. This was like a nylon material dress going into the summer. This was a great pickup and a great sale. And I sold this dress for $39. Next is the brand Nike. Nike can be very oversaturated. I only pick up Nike if it's something that stands out, something that's unique, or something that I kind of just have like a gut feeling on. Um, this was a Nike women's skirt. It was like a French terry skirt. It was a really just nice like knit material. And I kind of just had a feeling. I'm like, I hope that this sells. I think it will. I just had like a gut feeling when I picked it up. And I sold this skirt for $24. This was definitely another pickup that was like a gut feeling. I usually do not pick up things that don't have... Um, like a brand label and this was one of those things that didn't have like a brand name on it and I was like I, I really don't know like I don't like picking up things like that because then I can't look it up and I can't like find similar comps but this was just so different and so unique it was like a vintage it was mohair like cable knit sweater it was so intricate and so unique so I picked it up and I actually sold this within a week I sold this vintage sweater it was made in Italy on eBay for $49 next is another really really great brand it's called red van Lee I think it's a men's brand like a men's active performance brand I picked up two of these men's shorts actually both new with tags they both have sold very very quickly I sold these shorts for six $69. So if you find this brand, a really great pickup. Another brand I love is We The Free or Free People. This is kind of a brand you have to also pick up like something unique or something that's in style. I love picking up their wide leg or flare pants, jeans, their dresses sell really well. This was really different. They were a pair of jeans, but it, I like it was skirted, like it had a skirt that went around it. So it was a pair of wide leg denim skirt pants, I guess. They were called the apron wide leg pants and I sold these for $49. Another great men's and women's brand is BKE. I love selling BKE men's jeans. I like selling the women's as well if it's like a flare or a wide leg, but the BKE, they have boot cut or straight jeans. These were the men's BKE Tyler straight jeans and I sold these for $34. This was a really, really great sale. This was again, and it was Lauren Ralph Lauren it was 100% cashmere if you find really anything that's 100% cashmere it's usually a really great pickup even if it's not like a great brand I've been experimenting with cashmere items and they all sell really well but this was 100% cashmere it was a really nice soft women's um like cream colored cardigan and I had this listed for $99 but I had a buyer reach out and message me and we made a deal so I actually sold this on eBay for $75 which is a really great return on investment I only paid $4.49. Next is another great brand to be on the lookout for. It does not sell for a ton, but it is a fast seller every single time. It's Chico's Travelers, specifically only in the Chico's Travelers. They're slinky pants. They're like a pair of like acetate pull-on. They're called like the no tummy slinky pants. If you find these, they sell really, really fast for me between $20 and $23. So I sold these for $22.99. Next is Polo Ralph Lauren again. I like picking up the Ralph Lauren men's jeans that usually will have the style name like on the inside of the zipper or on the inside of the pocket. These were called the Hampton Straight Jeans and I can usually get between $24 and $30 for these. And I sold these for $29.99. Then we have Lucky Brand Jeans. I love selling men's Lucky Brand Jeans. Unfortunately, they don't sell 
um, for a ton of money like they used to. I used to get between like 30, 35, sometimes $40 for these jeans pre-owned. Um, but now I get between 20, I would say $22 to on the high end of $30. So I don't, I wouldn't pay up for these jeans. Like I know a lot of times thrift stores will mark these up like $11.99, $12.99, or if you live in like a really popular area, like 15, 20 bucks. Um, I am lucky I can get, pick them up for $4 and 49 cents. So that is why I picked them up and I flipped them between 25 and $30. So if you can do that, I would pick them up. So I sold these for $29.99. Next is another great brand that I love selling. It's J Jill, especially in the plus sizes, but I do still pick up J Jill in stuff that's not plus size as well. These were new with tags. They were a wide leg pant and I sold them for $39.99. Next, this was a new brand to me. It's a shoe brand and it's called Called Kane. I saw these in the thrift store. I saw a bunch of them. I looked them up. They had a 100% sell through rate. They were really cool and really different. They're like a slip on like speckle print shoe. I picked up six pairs of these and I have sold I think every single pair for good money. So I actually sold these on sale. I sold these for $39.99 but all the other pairs I have sold between $45 and $50. Next is a brand called Simply. This is a newer brand to me. Um, they make like I've been finding like vintage Simply tags and like the newer Simply tags um, but these are like a pair of like pull on pants. Um, and these sell really well. I've actually sold two pairs of these already. I did sell these on my sale as well. I sold these for $23.99. Then I sold my favorite brand. It's Lululemon. These were the Lululemon HR. They're really pretty like purple floral print legging. I love picking up Lululemon. It's kind of like Athleta where I try to stick to like the newer styles and something that's in style. So their shorts are really great. Their skirts are great. Their newer leggings are great. And I sold these on my sale for $39.99. Then we have a really great brand bolo brand to be on the lookout for it's called zadig and voltaire i think is how you pronounce it these were new with tags it's a great great brand i'd pick it up even not new with tags but i sold these shorts on my sale for 71 dollars 99 cents a really really great brand then another brand i've kind of been picking up and experimenting with is um banana republic banana republic surprisingly has a 100 sell through rate in the um style called the traveler jeans or the traveler pants they're men's and they this specific style of jeans and pants sells really really well which i was really happy to see so i sold these men's these were the chino pants the traveler pants i did sell them on my sale i sold them for 19.99 but i have sold their traveler jeans for between 24 and 30 dollars next under armor i love picking up the men's under armor shorts and pants they're like performance nylon spandex material i sold these on my sale for 19.99 next we have athleta i love picking up athleta in the newer styles i pick up athleta but, uh, not really in their leggings anymore unless it's like a brand new style but I love picking up like their joggers and their Cabo like wide leg pants this is a pair of Athleta joggers and I sold these on my sale for $31.99 next is Athleta again this is what I was talking about with the um newer styles this is wide leg and it's also linen which are two things that are in style right now so I picked these up and I sold these for $34 then we have the brand Eileen Fisher I love picking up Eileen Fisher especially it's kind of like jail if you can pick up eileen fisher in the plus sizes it's a major bolo sells very very quickly but i also love picking up eileen fisher in like size large xl as well these were a pair of like tensile pull-on pants and i sold these for 29.99 then we have the brand judy blue i love picking up judy blue this is a really great brand in the women's jeans they also make shorts um if you can find like their wide leg pants or straight leg pants or their bigger sizes sell really well as well so these were a pair of like wide leg crop jeans jeans and I sold these for $34.99. Then lastly, this is a newer brand to me and I'm so glad I picked these up because I almost didn't. There was a couple of them. It was called Matilda Jane and they didn't have a 100% sell through rate because I didn't know the style name at the time. So like I wasn't typing in the style name. I was just typing in like Matilda Jane pants. But this particular style, I picked up four pairs of these. I think one or two of them was new with tags and I've sold them all. It's like a ruffle ruffle pant i think it was called just imagine sophia was the brand name of these pants so i picked them up and i've sold them all I sold these for 34.99 so if you find that brand in this style specifically is like a, the ruffle 
um, I would definitely pick them up. And that is all for me. Just a couple sales that I've had the past couple weeks. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you know any of these brands or you pick any of these up at the thrift store, let me know in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you on the next video.